Hello everybody, this is a quick run through of all the features in Northern Needle Engine. It's the same as Yo-Yo's Engine, but with a bunch more things. So I'm just gonna quickly go through all the new things we got. So here we got a spike spinner, which is customizable in creation code, which can make spin slower, faster, or the other direction, of course. Got spikes that move up and down, and spikes that switch when you jump. Here we have Nan gimmicks. We got the Black Star, which only makes it so you can only single jump. Gray Star turns it back to normal. And Yellow Star gives you triple jump. Fast field, slow field, low gravity, high gravity. Here we got the See the Moon gimmicks. So the purple one will make it so you can only single jump. The green one will turn you back to normal. Yellow will make you move fast. Blue is high gravity. And red is low gravity, if I can reach it. There we go. And then green turns back to normal. Here we have uh, slow fall blocks. Not actually water, just slow fall. Here we have some wind field, which is customizable in creation code, which can make the player um, push faster. You can also make it go the other direction. We got push blocks, which is also customizable in creation code. You can make it so the player will push them faster or slower. And these push blocks will also work upside down. And they will also work with a dock head. As you can see. And we also have this gimmick where you touch these things. It will switch to you between dock head and normal kid. Like so and we also have breakable blocks. And we got an oscillation object. You can make some pretty cool things with that. Pretty cool effects, like as you can see right here. Here we have a like a fan type thing. It blows you up. Gives you some momentum. And also we have uh, screen wrapping. You can see how these interact. These will also work with docket, of course. Pretty cool. And normal kid. And here we got blocks and spikes that switch when you shoot. And if you stand on top of the block and you shoot it, you will die. Here we have I want to kill the guy cannons. These you can make shoot in any direction you want. You can make them shoot towards the player. And you can also slow down and speed up the bullets, which is customizable in creation code. And here we have the lasers, which you can turn on and off by either shooting or touching the button. Here we have some pretty interesting platforms, these lifts. When you stand on top of this, the other one will go up. And if the other one can't move, it'll stop. And as you can see, you have you can have multiple sets of these in a room. You gotta use creation code for that. Here we have jungle adventure vines. We got normal vines. We have slippery vines. We got gravity flipping vines. High jump vines. Sticky vines. Uh, vines that switch like this. Uh, vines that will make you go up instead of down. And long jump vines. You have walk the ceiling gimmicks. Got this uh, switch that will switch the spikes like so. So now these won't kill me, but the other ones will. Got the lasers, which you can either touch or shoot. Got these things, which you can only walk through if you're the correct gravity. You can switch gravity like this. So now I can walk through this one. But if I'm in the wrong gravity, then I cannot go through it. Here we have pastel spikes. These, when you shoot the green ones, it will spawn some green stuff that will let you pass through blocks. Like so. And we also have the 
blue spikes, which you can shoot to spawn water. And the black spikes you can shoot, which will make the movement move in a direction until it hits the wall. Uh, the blue and green spikes you can customize to change the uh, speed of the blocks. You can also make them destroy itself when you shoot it once, so, so it's only a one-time use. This is either that one's really fast, this one are really slow. You can customize those in creation code. Here we have the Yoshi gimmick. With Yoshi you can stand on these things. This still works fine. Screen wrapping works fine. Uh, push blocks work fine. Slopes work fine. You can bounce on these things. Hold jump to bounce higher. And if you walk through a spike, Yoshi will die and you'll gain some iframes. And also, you can blow his head off to gain an extra jump. Here are the gimmicks you should not use with Yoshi because it breaks stuff. So don't use those with Yoshi. Here we have uh, Run the Marathon, VVV gimmicks. If you grab this coin, you switch you to Blue Kid, and you can grab a flip like this. This will also work with Dot Kid. And grabbing the red coin will switch you back to normal. Here we have some apple circles. These are really interesting. Lots of stuff you can customize. There's four different types. Got the normal circle, you got a circle like this, you got this crazy thing and this crazy thing. Very cool stuff you can do with these. You can speed up, slow down, change how they move, etc. All done in creation code, of course. Here we have 8 bit. Standing on these will spawn a crocodile mouth. And when you touch these, it will start flashing, and then after some time, it will disappear. Everything of the same color. And this will also work by touching them from the side. Here are some cameras. When you shoot them, it'll spawn a kid where you're currently standing, a bit above you, and you can stand on it. You also can't shoot through it. You can make some cool puzzles with that. And we have thwomps. Uh, uh, uh. And that's all the features.